In 2007, after a lengthy and extensive search for a new headmaster, Rabbi Tzvi Khan was hired to lead our school. It is difficult to enumerate all the strengths Rabbi Khan brought to his position, but it is safe to say that his incredible energy and dedication to Jewish education, combined with his personal warmth, make a huge difference to Torah Academy. Unfortunately, Rabbi Khan informed us that he and his wife, Sarah Beth, who also has given so much to our school, in her position as a teacher in our learning center, along with their children, Avi, Shmuel, Rina, and Adira, will be leaving Columbus at the end of the school year. We could not let them leave without a proper thank you for their years of service. But a normal goodbye would not be what Rabbi Khan and Sarah Beth would want. So instead, <laughs> we are transforming the Hilton Ballroom into a stage production of Jeopardy! The Khan Family Special! <laughs> Alex Trebek! Thank you, and welcome, everyone, to an edition of Con Jeopardy, where contestants, like the students, ask the questions, and I provide the answers. Let's meet our contestants today. First, Abigail Rosenberg. Abigail, I understand you are a student at CTA. Tell me, what's it like, from a student's perspective, to attend a school populated by so many con children? Well, I guess there are some pros and cons. <laughs> of course. And our next contestant, Kate Willis. Kate is a fifth and sixth grade teacher at Columbus Door Academy. Kate, what's it like working in the lower school so close to the Learning Center and Sarah Beth Khan? Absolutely delightful. Her ability to bring out her students' strengths and yet patiently work on their weak areas is inspiring. Oh, and Alex, may I just say about Sarah Beth, chocolate drizzled popcorn. Mmm, sounds delicious. And Jonathan Hartstein, parent of three daughters at Columbus Tour Academy. Jonathan, what's it been like as a parent to work with the community led by Rabbi Khan? Well, Alex, as you know, communication is the key. And as you know, I live with four wonderful women and you could just ask them, I am a key communicator. <laughs> Very good. Well, let's play the game. Our categories tonight, name that con, house of cons, that is things known to so many who have enjoyed the con's hospitality, and con potluck. Abigail, you're first. I'll take name that con for 100. This con is most closely associated with shopping. Jonathan. Who is Rabbi Khan? No. Kate. Who is Shmuel Khan? No. Who is uh, Rena? Correct, Rena, of course, known by many to spend her waking hours at Easton. Avigal, your pick. Name that con for 200. This con is most closely associated with chocolate. Jonathan. Who is Shaka Khan? <laughs> no. Kate. Who is Sarah Beth? No. Abigail. Who is Adira? Correct. That's right. To Adira, the four food groups are milk chocolate, dark chocolate, white chocolate, and chocolate chips. <laughs> Abigail. Name that con for three. This con can smile his way out of any sticky situation. Jonathan? Who is Genghis Khan? <laughs> no. Kate? I know this one, Alex. That smile rescued a number of lost recess times. Who is Shmuel Khan? Correct. Your pick of the board, Kate. <clears throat> I'll take Name That Con for 400. This auteur is an experienced actor, writer, and filmmaker. 
Jonathan? Who is Star Trek Wrath of Khan? <sighs> no. Kate? I've seen many performances of this young man. Who is Avi Khan? Right again, Khan. Avi Khan, of course, the founder of the famous Khan Films. <laughs> Kate, your pick of the board. I'll take House of Khan for 100. Remember, these category, this category is about the fun activities held at the Khan household that so many have experienced. For 100, the Khans are known around the neighborhood for playing this sport on Sundays. What is Polly Pockets? No. Kate. What is bowling? No. Jonathan? What is football? Incredible, but correct. <laughs> Rabbi Khan and the boys welcome all friends and family to Sunday football in the park. Jonathan, your pick. Um, I would like, please, potluck for 100. It's Video Jeopardy. A celebrity guest will now read our next answer. Let's go to the monitor. Speaking and Sarah Beth, notwithstanding of how proud we have been of your integration into this wonderful Columbus community, we admire the courage of your difficult decision to relocate. We know that you will all be missed. Your question is, on long car trips to New York or New Orleans or Memphis to see us, the Khan family is known to do this. Thank you. That was J Jerry and Natalie Frager, parents of Sarah Beth. And their question was, on long car trips to New York and New Orleans or Memphis to visit them, the cons are known to do this. Jonathan? Run out of gas. No. Kate? What is sing? Correct. Imagine a carload or a table full of cons singing on down the road. Kate, your pick. Alex, I'll take potluck for two. Everyone knows that this Southern football team is the favorite of the cons. Football team from the South, they play in the Superdome. They win the Super Bowl. Jonathan? Who are the Rolling Stones? No. The Red Sox? I'm sorry. Kate. What is Manchester United? Uh, I'm sorry. I guess that nobody really cares about the New Orleans Saints. <laughs> Kate, your pick of the board. I'll try potluck for 300. It's another video Jeopardy. Let's take a look at the monitor and see what celebrity will be giving us the answer. Mazel tough to you, knocked the Daniel Chase. And mazel tov to you, Rabbi Tzvi and Sarah Beth Khan, and big mazel tov to the Columbus Torah Academy. Now, Tzvi and Sarah Beth, you all met at a Shabbaton under this wonderful organization. That was Saul and Carol Khan, parents of Rabbi Khan. Surprise, surprise. And their question was, Svi and Sarah Beth met at a Shabbaton at this wonderful organization. Jonathan. What is the CTA PTO? No. Kate. What is the Boy Scouts? No. Well, I'm a member. What is NCSY? Correct. NCS wires out there, you never know. <laughs> and so we've arrived at Final Jeopardy. Tonight's Final Jeopardy category is legendary CTA families, and tonight's Final Jeopardy answer is the Khan family.
Let's go to our answers. The final Jeopardy answer is the Khan family, Avigail. Which family's children have had a profound impact on the greater CTA community? By working in student government, by participating in athletics from soccer to basketball to baseball to volleyball, by being standouts in plays and Shakespeare performances and other community theater productions, by welcoming the community into their home, which has been an open house to all, and by helping out and being the first to volunteer for all manner of school and community projects. An excellent answer, Avi Gile, but I'm checking with our judges and we will now go to Jonathan. Which family's matriarch has brought the community together in so many ways through the midot of haknasat orachim, hospitality, or bikor cholim, visiting the sick, through the dessert making extraordinaire of all occasions for welcoming new families into the town of Columbus, Ohio, for her involvement in the mikvah, the J book, for always carpooling with the phone in her hand, <laughs> and doing all this with contagious enthusiasm and the sweet humor of Sarah Beth Kahn. Our judges are looking at that answer. Kate. Which rabbi has inspired students in his teaching, been a great travel companion on the senior and eighth grade trips, strengthened CTA through intelligent and proactive leadership, brought accountability to the headmaster role at CTA, exhibited creative problem-solving skills as well as visions to the community, set the bar for excellence for the CTA faculty, and has shepherded Columbus Tour Academy during the school's greatest era. Who is Rabbi Khan? Excellent answers all. We are checking with our judges. And it is my honor to announce that the winner of tonight's contest is the Khan family. Bring your bells. Will Rabbi Khan, Sarah Beth, Avi, Shmuel, Rina, Adira, please come forward. And I'd like to call up President Dan Chase to present an honor to the Khan family. Mazel tov, Mazel, right here. This is perfect, right here. Mazel tov. Looking good, man. Look at that suit. You getting married? Good job, bud. Mm -hmm. <coughs> um,